I get out now? No, I can't. Alrighty. Going back the way I came. Wow, well, um... Game. Way too loud for its setting. Under pistons and machinery is at risk. Sounds are very scary in this game. Full circle. I do not see anywhere where I'm supposed to go. Son of a crap basket. What am I doing? Where am I? Oh, crap. Alright, I can't see where I'm going because it's way too damn dark. Son of a crap basket. There's not even any insanity in this game. I can, like, look straight at the monster and be okay. Great. Uh... Where am I going? What am I doing? Holy crap, this back the way I came. Why am I saying stuff like that? I have no idea. Ow.
Okay, that wasn't so bad. I suppose. Danger. No naked flames. Got it. So I'm Flood Breach Immersion Nation. Yeah. The crate arrived this morning and I had it delivered directly to the workshop. The body is remarkably preserved, although there is a subtle yet nauseating stench of damp and rot. It is humanoid in shape, but has suffered severe skeletal deformity. Remnants of leather straps encase the torso, which is deformed, which with evidence of substantial muscle mass and displacement. It is difficult to ascertain whether this unfortunate is the recipient of some barbarous surgery or was born deformed and an attempt to force his gnarled body into some semblance of humanity was made. What he is I cannot tell, but I smell the orb upon him. Oh, mention of the orb! And suspect my great uncle's presence in this curious condition. In his curious condition. So it can be done. We can reshape the body into a tool, accelerate the process of Mr. Darwin's evolution. But here my great uncle and I part company. He chose men as the subject of his, of his experiments. But men are difficult to control and rotten with sentimentality. No, we require a new creature for our chattels. Lawyer, loyal, clever, strong, easily sated. Piggies! They used Miss Piggy! Um. What? Turn off. Great. Can I press this? Do I go in here? Highly corrosive, highly something mm, flammable. Oh, that was the way I went. <laughs> Okay, I guess I must have missed something by accident, by not going the other way. I apologize if I did miss anything. In the nest of eggs, through penny, sixpence, sparrows, and doves, see all the angels are weeping above, there's just no more forgiven, there's no one to save, and I didn't get to read the rest because I forgot to read. <laughs> And that is why you should never ride a dumbwaiter. Never. Ever. Bad. Don't do it. You'll die. <coughs> oh. So let's read a journal. Quickly, Mantis. Find the entrance nearby. The children weep in the darkness, and the flood waters continue to rise. <coughs> Nope. I highly doubt that I think the children are dead. What did that dark voice instruct me to do? Under the pistons, into the tunnels, and onto the bilge pumps? And if the door should be locked, I will find I have another means of descent. I cannot trust him, but my path is set. I shall ignore those noises, that snuffling, those snuffling steps below me. I will brave whatever lurks, lurks beneath, and I will save them. Sabotage! Bruised and battered but alive, I have survived the saboteur's best efforts. He and I are now locked in an epic struggle, but I am driven to find my family, and I will prevail. Ignore the madness about me. Do not consider what cruel and unspeakable acts have been committed here. Find the way to the bilge, drain the flood for your children. 
And holy crap, the blue haze is back with a vengeance. In order to facilitate a simulation of tissue groups, a compound is required, or the cells will not bond. Disposal of non-bonded subjects must be immediate and use incineration or we risk continuous animation with that form. This is unpleasant. A simple compound of one part Brennenberg and ah infusion vitae with one part organ monad dispersal fluid is sufficient. This can then be administered intravenously to subjects following reassembly to maintain bonding. The compound is unstable and highly light reactive. Once in the body, the Schumann lamp can be used to activate the compound, but outside the body is highly corrosive. It can even destroy small quantities of metal. La bulb. Oh. There is clearly another passage beyond the locked gates, it seems I have a choice of approach. The padlock is all but firm, and after that fall I cannot summon the strength to break it open. Perhaps I can find another way. But, but, eh, uh, uh, what did I just do? Ah, dick growth. Hey, look, Harry Potter glasses. Chair. 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 Really? I can't lift the chair up. Down we go. Oh, there's probably more pigmen. Oh, it's a little Aztec temple. Mm, nothing there. I don't know why I'm looking through these drawers when I know for a fact that the only thing that's going to be there are either useless items or papers. Which I suppose, and in, in, in that case, it's going to be a lot of reading. Centrifuge. It's some form of bizarre mixing device for chemical compounds, and it is positively reeks of foul fluids, fluids I have seen too far often before. It is clearly a compound, some volatile bastard of two composite ingredients. I should wager I find them close by. Low temperature storage. Holding pens. Um, oh, low temperature storage. What is it, Isis? No, don't. Oh! Crappity crap. Inflamed it is burn uh, it is. Burning it does, bleeding from each hole, a four a fore and aft, leaking down my legs. Blood and excrement, my lungs are in my vomit, I pass clots of my organs now onto the filthy stone. Drink this, he says, and I did drink it. I did do that. Because of the changes, they ripple inner me. My teeth sneeze out and scatter like mice in the dark. I cannot find them all. Gathered what I can, push them back into my gray gums with my fingers, but the nails are all weepy and falling out. Drink it, he says. It'll help the running of the fever, because not all of us can take the change. On the other table, a beast under a blanket. I never wanted to see it under that, but he drank it, too. He passed it under the blanket, and I heard it drink. Dear God Almighty, how can a man shed so much blood and still live?
That was easy. That door was closed. There's someone else. My gosh. Okay, time to run. Got it. And I'm in the dark. So <gasps> Oh, son of a whore. Huh. Oh. How the hell did I get there? It fell onto his hands and they eroded in front of him. <sighs> to oh my to gosh. Stumps. Next time we will use an equal mix of infusion vitae and orgone disperser. No, no, just take him out. You can dump him in the river for all I care. <laughs> <laughs> 